morning do you know what today i got up and i made my bed and then sat on it instead of laying in it for ages and the room looks much brighter and nicer when i haven't got like 700 quilts on the floor and 15 cushions lying around um also i've been doing i've been selling some stuff for vintage so if i have time this morning after i've sent i have three emails to do um and i've got a couple of social media posts to send and hopefully sort of tomorrow or the day after i'll be meeting up with um this lady who owns a jewelry business she makes rings and jewelry and stuff by hand and my mum got her engagement ring from the shop and they had a social media marketing person role come up i don't know if it's going to be like if i can do it freelance or part-time because that's what i'm looking for but that would be really good so that was a good thing to wake up to um so yeah i'm feeling good today i'm excited uh taking out my boyfriend's nan for tea and cake at water perry so i'll get as many videos of that as I can. i'll show you some of the things i'm selling on vintage i cannot believe how quickly things sell i was going through it one evening and i was looking at everything for like 20 30 minutes i dedicated to like finding stuff i wanted to buy next morning it's all fucking sold already so annoying reformation formation dress 10 pound maxi dress really nice sold obviously it's going to be sold but do you know what i mean i think but i need new trainers because mine look pretty dirty in the inside it's kind of embarrassing when i take them off um and also i realized yesterday because i wear a lot of like white and cream and i looked down at the laces of my trainers and i was like giving grow so yeah the mugs from like i think the isle of wight we got these or my nan got these really cute little um coffee pots and then she found a matching mug somewhere else my dream, I'm not gonna lie, my absolute dream would be to like design mugs and bedding and stuff like that and cards and have a little shop. Gorge. The only thing is, I can't, I can't paint. So I kind of need to be able to draw if you're gonna do designs. But I could learn. And I wanna do mosaic. Or I just make silly trinkety things and live in a big manor house that doesn't really match up to the money I'm earning. Too much to ask? How funny a day can be so hectic without even leaving your bloody bed. It's been stressful. Today. Ignore the mess behind me, but today's been quite stressful, you know. I haven't even left my bed. I've been doing all my work from my bed. And even still, been hectic getting ready now have about oh, like 20 minutes so this is water perry it's got gardens it's got a cafe and it has gift shops and sort of more garden centery shop as well um really nice cushions and stuff a lot of these places are just so much more upmarket now um, and it is a nice place to get gifts, especially for grandparents, because they deserve it. And a good one for mums or aunties or something, I think. Um, but there were lots of cute things. And the faux flowers were amazing. Really, really pretty bouquet. They're so good now, the faux flowers that you can buy. They also press their own apple juice, which is really sweet. And they have, like, honey you can buy. Once we were done there, we dropped Ollie's nan off and then we saw Laura because it's her birthday and we went to the Dorchester Abbey near Abingdon. Girl! Okay. <laughs> we're staying! <laughs> Mm. Cup, no, you cup, cup, okay. it's just a 
goodness. Mmm, that is good. watching Black Mirror now. <laughs> Been to Dorchester Abbey, taking the nan out. <laughs> and I think we just did food shop and I think we're gonna book holiday for Ollie's B day. Well, two two day trip, I think. Or three day, two day. Not sorry, what you do. A guardian angel. I think you're gonna I hope you enjoyed touring the wonderful tea room and the gift shops and then dorchester abbey it really is a special place if you'd like to see other special places then have a look on our channel as we have many many adventures and we capture them often thank you bye